So what's going on everyone? Got a lot of criticism in my video with the lower triple fan mod. So I am making another video to show you the GPU upper triple fan mod on the NZXT H1 right here. We have the three fans right in the back. These are fractal design, same ones I used in the bottom, 50 millimeters. They push out a decent amount of air. I actually have some benchmarks that I created with these fans. They fit as a friction fit, I would call it. You could use two-way tape, but there's actually no need for them. They fit pretty snug in there. They're not gonna move. Take off the front cover. Get these out of the way. Your wiring is gonna run right behind the GPU, nice and tight. It's a close up of the fans. These are all pretty tight in there. You could use double sided tape on both sides of them if you opt for that. But as for the wiring, it fits nice and snug right behind. You can use a three way fan connector. The power draw on these is 0 0.08 amps. So you could probably put about over 10 of them on one chain if you want to stick to the one amp. So throughout my testing on these, I've tested with the front cover on, which is to me the most restrictive part of this case. And I've noticed that the fans help they're dropping about eight degrees. With the front cover off, the entire case temperature drops about 15 degrees. This thing is just an absolute hot box, and I'm sure you noticed that it's gutted. I've opted to end my relationship with this cute little case, and I have since moved on to the Sliger. SM580. This is an excellent case. The thermals are unbelievable in this. I'm only using the NZXT 140 AAO. There are no bottom fans, no top rear fan. I'm going to put a comparison video up of these two cases just to show you the thermals on them. But I'm going to post the chart now so you can check out my thermals on here with the three fans and glass on and off. So all of my testing was done with the Radeon 7 in the H1 case and I'm going to explain the graph. Fans off with the front cover on was 78 Celsius. Fans on with the front cover on was 70 Celsius. Fans off with the cover off was 57 Celsius. No cover, no fan, 55 Celsius. You have a great improvement just by taking that front cover off. It, to me, just ditch the case. The thing is as good as scrap. It's a complete hot box. Grab something like this. It's a little bit more affordable. It's a lot better, nicer to build in, although the H1, it was pretty easy to build since they had the cables rooted practically for you. All you had to do was just stick your stuff in there. But this Sliger seems like a great case. I would even think about getting the SM550 or 560. The nice thing about this is you got the three GPU slot, tons of fans, but we're not getting into this case. Um, H1, do your three fans on the back side. Is it going to help? Yeah, a little bit. You're going to drop out six, six Celsius. Is it worth it? I have no clue. I would just ditch the case because I've dropped over 14 degrees just by switching to this one. So, hope you liked the video. I have some evidence now to back it up. I've done some testing myself. Have a great day, everyone.